What's going on, ladies and gents? It's Richard Quo. I'm really excited about this week's topic of how do you achieve your dreams? Two things I want to mention this week. The first one is if you're trying to achieve a dream that you have, the first one is we need to stop focusing on, on our past and focus on the future. So oftentimes, like let's say we have a dream of, uh, I'm, I'm just going to use my own personal example. Uh, I, I have this dream of uh, starting up a podcast and uh, I want to create like an online community uh, to help people break through their self-worth conversations and really go after whatever it is they want in their life. Uh, I want to grow my speaking business. Like I have this, like I have these really big goals and like I, I want to make a difference in the world. But like there's so many things that's holding me back. And a lot of those things that are holding me back is things of my past. A lot of limiting beliefs I've had about myself like Richard, uh, you know, your, your work ethic isn't that great or Richard, you're, you know, like you're not... You don't have all the tools you, you you need in order to be successful, you know. And I realized that I've been spending so much time focusing on my past that all my energy is going to the to that instead of focusing on my future, focusing on what can I do to become successful. And instead of like, check this out. So um, I'm going to use my real life example right here. I feel like I've been spending like 80% of my time doubting myself and focus on the person that I am and 20% of my time focus on, okay, how can I do this? What if I spent 80% of my time uh, focus on taking action and doing things to get me to my, my dream and only 20% like thinking about my past? And then what if we I just spent 100% focus on my future and screw just thinking about my past? So I think this is so essential. I think oftentimes what gets in, in our way of becoming uh, of fulfilling our dream is our own self-limiting belief, our own conversations we have in our mind that says like, ah, oh, no, I don't, I don't, I can't do that, you know. So let's stop focusing on the past and let's focus on the on the future. Um, point number two, the final point is uh, very similar to a video I made uh, I think last week, and it's the concept of um, don't overthink, just take action. So. Oftentimes, like we're so busy, we're like, oh, okay, this is our dream. How do we, how do we become a uh, NBA superstar? How do we become LeBron James, you know, and um, Kobe Bryant? <laughs> and um, we're so focused on this, and we think we gotta map everything out. And like, yes, yes, it's a good idea to have some sort of plan, but sometimes, sometimes it's more important to just take action. Sometimes we just need to uh, just stop, like. Stop overthinking things and just take action. I realize uh, for my my own dreams, my own goals, and this probably applies to most people's, is if I wanna be successful, all I gotta do is just start taking action. I gotta start uh, reaching out to people to, to book interviews with people uh, for my podcast. I have to start uh, formulating my online community, reaching out to people. And one other thing I want to mention is I think a lot of us, uh, I'm just speaking from my own personal perspective and opinion, is we're so focused on becoming like being perfectionist. We just, we wanna make sure that everything goes out right so we don't fail and we don't feel bad or sorry for ourselves that we, you know, we're a loser and we can't do it. You know, we want things to uh, approve or uh, what, what's that, affirm that we're doing the right thing. Sometimes we just have to take action and we gotta fail. Like, that's why you might have heard a quote or many quotes saying, like, um, you know, like, the greatest leaders, the greatest like influencers are the ones who aren't afraid to fail. Um, what is it? Michael Jordan says like, I can accept failure, but I can't accept not trying. And like, it's funny because I never really, this never really like resonated in my mind until like this moment right here, right now that I'm talking it out. But essentially what I'm getting is Michael Jordan is saying like, you gotta try, like, don't be afraid to fail. Like, you know, if you want to do something, if you have a dream, start taking action. Start taking action and don't be afraid to fail. Like, like, okay, here's the thing. The best way to achieve your goal is to just take action and fail along the way. Like, just try it out. Like, don't think too much, just do it. And when we overthink things because we want things to be so perfect, that's when things take way too long. That's when we spend 80% of our time doubting ourselves and 20% taking action versus vice versa, you know? So that's what I got. If you want to achieve your dreams, number one, stop focusing on your past, focus on your future. I know this is backwards because I'm looking at a mirror image. So stop focusing on your, on your past, focus on your future. And also uh, just take action. Don't overthink things, all right? Uh, 
I would love to hear, you know, what are your big dreams that you have in your life? So feel free to, uh, please, please, please comment down below. I'm just really curious to know, like, um, what are your dreams? Like, what do you want to accomplish in your life? And um, if this video was helpful, please be sure to share it and like it and just comment. And uh, I would just really appreciate that because I'm still trying to grow my own channel. Thank you so much for watching. Love you all. Peace. Take care. Uh, if you ever find yourself like just stuck in your mind, like you're so overwhelmed, like I have so much to do, my tip to you is to just take, just take action. Um, take simple action. You know, sometimes we feel so overwhelmed by how much we have to do that it just feels like it's never going to end.